everyone. Zach Elliott at Feel Free to Argue. Uh, I wanted to record something today uh, on 9-11 because if anything we seem less at peace as a nation than we did all those years ago right after it happened. Uh, more divided, more angry. And so I, I wanted to read something that I had found a little while ago. Um, Roger Ebert, who I actually like his political writing, even more than his movie reviews a lot of the time. It's not surprising that people who are uh, movie and theater critics are actually pretty good uh, analysts of our political situation because uh, so much of it is just a big dumb show. But anyway, um, he wrote uh, a thing called, what was it, 10 Things I Know About the Mosque. And it was a, an imperfect article. But the, the last point really, really hit home with me. Um, it was just a little article that he wrote. Um, and I thought I would read point number 10 for you today as my statement about the day. I wonder how many Americans realize the community center is not intended for ground zero. What will be constructed there includes a 55,000 square foot retail mall this mall will be deep enough to connect with subway lines. Deep enough, that is, to theoretically be embedded in the ashes of some of the 9-11 victims. What might have been more appropriate? On September 12th, 2001, I wrote a little op-ed column. A Green Field. If there is to be a memorial, let it not be of stone and steel. Fly no flag above it, for it is not the possession of a nation, but a sorrow shared with the world. Let it be a green field, with trees and flowers. Let there be paths that wind through the shade. Put out park benches where old people can sun in the springtime, and a pond where children can skate in the winter. Beneath this field will lie entombed forever some of the victims of September 11th. It is not where they thought to end their lives. Like the sailors of the battleship Arizona, they rest where they fell. Let this field stretch from one end of the destruction to the other. Let this open space among the towers mark the emptiness in our hearts. But do not make it a sad place. Give it no name. Let people think of it as the green field. Every living thing that is planted here will show faith in the future. Let students from all lands take a sunny corner of the field and plant a crop there, perhaps corn, our native grain. Let the harvest be shared all over the world with friends and enemies, because that is the teaching of our religions. Let the harvest show that life prevails over death, and let the sharing show that we love our neighbors. Do not build again in this place. No building can stand there. No building, no statue, no column, no arch, no symbol, no name, no date, no statement. Just the comfort of the earth to remind us that we share it. <laughs> 